what, what else? Thing or two. Well, we are live officially at the Black Panther premiere right here in Osaka. It's the VIP premiere brought to you by PR Go Media and also brought to you by Manda Hill. So it's happening right here at Sturkenico Cinemas. And it's a place to be for those who managed to get themselves a ticket with only 1,000 kwacha. Yes, I said it, only 1,000 kwacha. And also by invite, because there's different celebrities, different public figures who are present here. I'm able to spot a couple interesting names, very popular names, and we'll be speaking with a lot of these people on this. In fact, it's not a red carpet, it's a black carpet, because look, it's Black Panther, so we have to stick to that theme. My name is Chumweka, and most of the times, if you see my face, it's probably on Diamond TV, but here we are on Web to TV. So we're speaking with different public figures who are here, waiting to grace the uh, watch the event. Actually, watch the movie Black Panther, which is uh, the 30th film by Marvel Studios. So the premiere did happen uh, in other countries. In Africa, the first was in Nigeria just a few days ago, and uh, the European premiere happened about six days ago as well. So here in Zambia, the exclusive premiere is happening tonight. So the people around here who have the exclusive experience and let's hope they will not give any spoilers after they're done watching the show all right let's get to speaking with the people who are here i'm able to spot a few people um i'm able to spot the z podcast crew i can see k plus i can see elson come through brother man come through come through come through well, uh, you guys are supposed to be the other side. Oh, yeah. We're trying to make a sandwich of you, so look. Yeah, used to being the host, so hey, you know. So I think we put you first. Trying to put you in the middle. Yeah. Not forgetting it's on our shows. So. Yeah. yeah. So it's easier to navigate the microphone actually from left to right. Yeah. I think well, it's easier like this. Right. Then, you see it? You get it? Yeah. Welcome to the place, uh, gentlemen. Thank you very much, bro. Looking absolutely amazing. Uh, I know you guys, you've hosted the PR Girls before on your Z podcast. Yeah. Uh, you're here for, you're not there at the Osaka July. I, I saw Elsa. Well, the, the country saw Elsa. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Please don't remind people of that. But let's talk about Wakanda forever. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about Black Panther. From the 2018 movie itself and the expectations tonight. Oh, what a. Yeah. Is that how far back it was? I know, right? It's 2018. Was that Jesus that was last year? Christ. I thought it was last year. It was like last year. Anyway. What are your expectations tonight, though? <laughs> um, I've got very low expectations because, well, Chadwick Boseman is not there, but I trust Ryan Coogler in creating a, a sequel that I think is going to kill. I was listening to his interview yesterday on the Wakanda Forever podcast, and they were talking about how the script was written with Chadwick in mind, but then he died. They had to redo the whole script. So it's a bit intriguing for me to see how they managed to make it happen without the star that they started with, you know what I mean? So for me, that's what I'm looking out for, to see if they managed to pull it off without Chadwick Boseman. Mm. Yeah. Uh, Elson, what are you looking forward to tonight? You know, you know what's crazy is, Bluseke actually looks like Ch Chadwick, Chadwick Boseman. Boseman yeah. have, have you seen yeah. him tonight? No, 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 I haven't seen him. Oh, you need to look for him. Um, you need to look for him. Look for I swear to God, he yeah. looks exactly like, like him. Chadwick Boseman, yeah. Now I'm on the lookout. Yeah. 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 Um, I don't know. I'm looking forward to the Rihanna song. And when in the movie it drops, the second that it does, I'm going to leave. <laughs> Why? You've got, you got, you got some hate for Rihanna? No, a crash for her. So when her song so plays, that's it, the movie's done for then the movie's done oh, for me. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. yeah. All right, cool. get it now. Yeah, no, I get it. I totally get it. Um, let's talk about also people showing up tonight and people's outfits. You already talked about uh, one of the persons here who you feel looks like. Uh, for a second, man. Yeah. Let's see how it looks like. Look for, dude in, look for the tallest yeah. dude in here. Yeah. I, th I thought you guys also get like your faces painted or something like that. We should. Where, where are you having this thing done from? Uh, so just by the entrance, when you're coming in at your far right, it also doesn't look like he's going to do it. No, I'm not. Soap is expensive, my man. <laughs> I don't know where the hell you people get all this soap to wash this makeup off your faces, but no, nah, I'm not going to do it. He's got kids, so I understand why he would want to do it. Yeah. 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 What, what, what? Did you think about bringing the kids here as well, or are you going to bring them later? Um, we are planning on a Saturday thing, but I want to see how family-friendly the movie is first. I don't know, Marvel is usually family-friendly, right? Yeah, usually. Yeah. Usually. Well, I'm like five and three, so 
Well, maybe because of how those girls are dressed, maybe a titty might slip out. <laughs> so yeah. I don't know if. <laughs> wait, can we say that on your platform? Oh, it's on the internet though, so we can say titty, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah you, you can, you can. All right, cool. But yeah, look, uh, gentlemen, we're gonna meet again later at the after party. I hope I can see you for that, and we have a good time. Definitely be there. Let's right, go to drinks, man. All right, have a good night. Nice watch, Jamaica. Thanks. All right, that's uh, Elson and. Uh, Kalenga as well, aka K Plus on uh, the black carpet here. Obviously, know them from the Z podcast. And we have more personalities. We've got two beautiful ladies. So, from two gentlemen to two ladies, allow me to welcome Natasha, just Natasha or just Tash, and the one and only. My name. No, 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 I didn't forget your name. Um, I was just, uh, no, 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 why does everyone think that's what we need to do? I think that's what no, we no. need to do. Look, it, it's easier to navigate the microphone. Oh, ah, like okay, okay, oh. if you insist, here's the girl, here's okay. the girl. Okay. What, what I was about to say is, um, the lady with the dollars. <laughs> wow. To work out, really? Is that my name now? No, but you can have some mercy on me, if, if, that, if that's okay. Talk to me nicely. That's your thing. <laughs> Ladies looking absolutely beautiful, first of all. Thank you very much, Mweka. Wakanda forever, Black Panther. What are you looking forward to tonight? Um, honestly, this is partly in memory of Shadwick, and we're super excited. And the other part is sad because, you know, we know he's not in the sequel. But Black Panther is um, something that's deep-rooted in us as Africans. So this is super exciting to see. And having a launch in our, you know, our home here in Zambia is something very huge for us. And we're excited. Mm. Yeah. Uh, Mercy, what are you looking forward to tonight? Um, honestly, I really loved the first one. One, and I'm just hoping that the, oh you know how it is with sequels I'm hoping that this one is even better than the first one and I'm so excited that the promo uh, the music for the promo was done by our very own Sapa the Great that is very exciting I feel very proud to actually stand here because I know that in as much as this is Hollywood it has got a touch of Zambia to it yes. and that is just lovely <laughs> Yeah. Let's talk about your outfits tonight. Uh, who dressed you? What was the inspiration behind it? Okay, so for my outfit, obviously Wakanda Forever, keeping it a little traditional but also Hollywood and fun. This is a movie premiere. And so this is um, an old dress I kind of altered. It was a long gown and then I altered it to this. And then my makeup was done by Theo, the makeup artist, and um, my hair was done by Julie. So everything is local. Um, Amba Tungani is the one that altered my dress. And yeah, so everything is uh, local, is Laka mm. today. Beautiful. Mercy, let's talk about your amazing outfit as well. So uh, I came here as a warrior. Okay. You can see this slit, it's so I can. <laughs> can people see the slit? <laughs> So I can, I, can, I can make all the movements that I need yeah. to make. Uh, but my hair is by um, Luscious Beauty and my makeup is by Theo, the makeup artist. And my dress is by Yellow Stiletto. Okay. Yeah. I'm trying to look, I'm like, where are her pockets? Where would she put the dollars? You know what I mean? Like, where would the dollars bag, be? Baby. Oh, oh, oh. Worry, I have a bag. It's over there. Have you come with security or, or something? Of course, now. <laughs> Ladies, it's been nice speaking with you. I can't believe Mercy thought I didn't know her name. I've, I've, I've had a crush on Mercy for a while and I can't believe she thought I forgot her name. Really? What is you feeling? But I, I told you, Mercy. But Honey. Like, oh, yeah, we need to go. Send me a bouquet with more dollars. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Thank you so much Woo. for having us. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you. <laughs> All right. That's uh, Mercy Mukwiza and Just Tash, aka Natasha Vandermas, at the uh, VIP premiere of Black Panther right here at Manda Hill Mall. Just right outside Strokenical Cinemas is where this is taking place. Remember, those are coming through 1,000 Quattro for a VIP ticket, and also the rest are coming through via invite. And they're looking forward to watching the movie tonight. And I've, I've been telling them right before we've been starting this live broadcast that, guys, listen, 
even as much as you watch the movie, do not go out and give spoilers to people. People would have not watched the movie until tomorrow, which is the official date of the premiere, the 11th of November. So it's a lot to look forward to as people watch this movie. A lot of excitement, not only for Zambians, but also for people across the continent, across the world, because there's a lot of tracking back to their African roots. There's a lot to look forward to and to appreciate as well. So that's why many people are very excited about it. But I'm also excited to speak with more personalities. Right now I'm about to speak with an actress. Nasi is here. You know what's funny? Here's the funny thing on everything. Everyone keeps thinking I've forgotten their names or I do not know their names. I was looking at you. Like I want to hear him say my name. Mercy thought I forgot a name or I didn't know a name. And I saw you looking like, oh my goodness, yes, did he forget? Like, do I have to sign language or something? Right now. Welcome to the Black Puppet. You're looking amazing. You're looking beautiful. Oh, you look amazing too. Thank you. Um, let's talk about, first of all, you're an actress. You've, you've acted in quite a number of films as well. When we talk about a movie like this, Black Panther Wakanda Forever, the 2022 sequel, what are you looking forward to as a fan and as an actress? I'm looking forward to see uh, Black Panther start firstly as a female. That, I want to see how that works out. So that's like the, the thing for me. Okay. Yeah. All right. What did you enjoy about the, the 2018 movie? The technology was crazy. Yeah. I, I love the depiction of Africa like that. Mm. Like high tech, nobody's ever seen it hidden, it's a gem. Mm. I love that. Mm. So I'm, I'm also excited to see what they're gonna do in this this movie, yeah. technology wise. Technology wise, hey, pretty interesting to talk about that. But let's also talk about your outfit. Uh, who designed the outfit? Uh, what it also inspired? I designed it. Okay. A lady called Mohau tailored it. My shoulders are made from vibranium, okay. I will say. Okay. All right. yeah. <laughs> yeah. And when we look at the people around here, uh, what, do you, what do you think about how people brought the fashion? Because look, we've had the Nigerian premiere, people look amazing. In Europe, obviously look amazing. But what do you think about how people are dressed so far? I think people understood the assignment. Mm. Yeah, they brought it. All I see is royalty. Yeah. The men and the ladies look amazing. Yeah, yeah. definitely. You know what? I'll see you at the after party. Thank you so much. All right. Thanks for speaking with us. All right. So that's uh, Nasi, actress uh, and uh, also entrepreneur who was speaking with us. All right. All right. We've got some more interesting outfits coming through. Um, uh, now, you know, I was talking about names and remembering names, but this is Fern, right? Man, I know my people in this industry. Fern, how are you doing? I'm doing all right. How are you? I'm all right. I, I want to be asked too much because um, I know that the person who designed your your outfit designed my jacket as well. Interfessional Africa? Exactly, Interfessional Africa, Zambia. Tell us about the outfit. You've brought it looking absolutely amazing. Uh, tell us what was running through your mind even when you were thinking of this outfit. Well, um, Black Panther is a movie that has supported us, so I think the best way we can do is support it by dressing like them. And we're Africans, so we need to dress like Africans. This is real Africa, you yeah. know what I mean? So I was inspired, this, I was, I was inspired by this um, warrior in Black Panther. I'm sure you're going to see him. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not going to say much, I'll spoil the movie. Yeah. yeah. Look, friend, you are now an award winner. You've been winning awards back to back. Congratulations for that, first of all. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. But look at you now, you're the one in front of the camera. Look at you now you're the one who's now dressing up and you're leaving your photographer friends in the background why are you doing this friend <laughs> um it's time I'm, I'm still going back behind the camera yeah. i just came to show my outfit off i wouldn't just sleep on it yeah but work is work yeah <laughs> so you're a photographer obviously still images and so on but with black panther there's a lot of motion graphics a lot of motion uh, visuals and so on but in a movie like this what are you looking forward to um i'm looking forward to learn there are angles that I want to learn. Um, I want to see how the technology has, has moved according to the type of work that I do. Learning never stops, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, Finn, enjoy the movie tonight and enjoy the after party coming soon. Oh, yeah, definitely. Wakanda forever. Look, uh, people keep on moving. My camera person is not very happy about that. So we need people to come right next to me, uh, even if they don't want to be. But next person coming next to me is the one and only Tandi Vundamina. Hi, how are you doing? I'm good, Jumwega. How are you? I'm okay. I haven't seen you in a while. Good to see you. I know. Good to see you too. Looking right. Mm. Thank you. Very dashy. Uh, I'll tell you a little bit of a secret. I don't know if you remember this. What happened? Um, remember when you were leaving Lusaka, July? Yes. Do you remember that we met? 
Yes, I remember. Who was in your passenger seat on the passenger seat? Was it you? No, 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 no. On the passenger seat. So I you don't remember? remember. <laughs> Mercy was on the passenger seat. Oh yes, yes, yes. And, and I and I said something to Mercy. What did you tell her? Oh my goodness! So no one remembers this. It's fine. I was talking to Mercy earlier on. What did you tell her? I don't remember. I was, I was telling Mercy I once had a crush on her. You had a crush on Mercy. But I, I told you this with her. <laughs> oh, you know what? But I can't remember. I actually can't remember. So she didn't remember as well, right? She didn't remember oh, as well. Oh, wow, wow. But, but right now I'm saying because I want some dollars from her. <laughs> oh, yes. Maybe you can I connect me. I want some dollars. You know, I saw her. I'm just like, girl, we need to talk. Yeah. Like, seriously. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> but you know what? Let's talk about your outfit looking absolutely amazing, first of all. Uh, let's talk about who put this outfit together, the inspiration in relation to uh, Black Panther. Okay, so the person who put it together is Anik, Afrinik. Mm. She's so good at, you know, hats, fascinators. So her inspiration, if you look, there's a braid there. Mm. The Black Panther and the spikes, the wooden spikes. Yes. And yeah, so she was just like, let me put something together for you. And I'm like, okay. And she did this. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. But when we talk about the movie in itself, what are you looking forward to tonight? Oh. I think I'm going to be very emotional. Because of Shadwick? Because, yes, you know, so, but I'm looking forward to just seeing the transition of everyone and it's, I've been waiting for this for what? Is it a year, two years? Yeah, from yeah. like 2018, yeah. From 2018, so yes, I'm, I'm, I'm really just looking forward to everything and every character, how every character comes together and how they've evolved and how they're growing and yeah. Mm. When we look at the fashion side of things, uh, Nigeria had the premiere just recently. People dressed really well. Yeah. Europe also had the premiere dressed really well. Yeah. Uh, what do you think about the outfit so far? That's if you've taken time to look. I have taken time to look. It looks like everybody got the assignment right. Yeah. They understood the assignment. I love it. And um, everyone is bringing their own unique thing, what they feel Wakanda is about. And I think every African feels like Wakanda is Africa, you know. So it's like that pride in us that we're bringing out tonight. All right. Yeah. Tandy, I'm going to let you enjoy the rest of the night and enjoy the movie. Thank you. All right. Just from speaking with uh, Tandy Vumdamina, actress, media personality, entrepreneur as well. And there's more public figures we are seeing around this place at the black carpet. I'm trying to take a look around and see where I can spot and just call them with my eyes. That's my look. I'll say, hey, you need to be here and come through and speak with us about Black Panther in itself, the movie that people are here to watch tonight. A lot of excitement and a lot of buzz also has gone towards this, especially for the VIP premiere that only a few are getting to experience tonight. But the official premiere uh, for the rest of the world, for everybody else, is happening tomorrow, the 11th of November, just in case you feel like you've missed it. And I know people still want to come through and watch at their own time. They want to come through with their families and so on. So you can expect it at a place like here, Mandy Hill, Stir Chemical Cinemas, to be precise, you can look forward to that and uh, watch it at your convenience. Those who are big on movies, I'm aware that some people apparently would even get the opportunity to watch the first one from a couple years ago, but they'll still be here today. Others managed to catch up as well and see what's really going on. And then there's others again who are just like, hey, somebody played is on uh, an American uh, film, a song is an American film somewhere. Yeah, we're talking about the uh, the trailer where we had our very own Sampa the Great. I know a lot of buzz, a lot of conversation also came around the official uh, track list of all the soundtracks where Sampa's name did not come out. We saw the likes of Rihanna being on the list instead. And uh, like one of the guests I was speaking to from the Z Podcast, Elson, he's a big fan of Rihanna. And for him, once he just hears Rihanna's song, he's out. But if there's people who are here now, we're talking about... <laughs> The, uh, you know what? No, 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 please come through. Please come through. Please come closer. Okay, why, why do people think I do not know their names? I don't know. Like, you actually. Tony, I've talked to you a number of times. We've worked together. And you still think I don't know your name? Maybe. <laughs> What in the world? What's your name, my brother? See, I yeah, told yeah, you. Thank you very much. I knew it. Yeah, thank I knew you very it. Much. I knew it. <laughs> Charles. 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 Of course I knew your name, Charles. How can you think? You know, like, you know, King Charles, you know. No, 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 my no, grandfather no. was Charles. I know a couple of Charles around. Maybe. Maybe if you put it that way. <laughs> Let's talk about... Uh, <laughs> Maybe that's... Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's talk about uh, the movie tonight. I'll start with you, Tony. What are you looking forward to? Look, 
on my part, I'm a diehard Marvel fan. I'm here for the movie. Uh -huh. Yeah, like I'm looking forward to. I want to know who's the new Black Panther. Yeah. Like who's the new Black? Oh. If it's Shuri. You know what? I was wondering. I, I, I promise. I promise. I was just about to ask, saying, where is Masulan? <laughs> anyway, let, let's let's let Tony continue. Yeah, you're saying uh, you're looking forward to seeing all the Black Panther. I'm just a, a diehard Marvel fan. I've invested in this. Yeah. I'll buy the most expensive match for Marvel. Because I love this. Yeah. Yeah. So I just want to know who is the new Black Panther. Uh -huh. I know there's no more. I don't know how you pronounce them. No more. But I want to see. That's actually who I'm looking forward I to the most. You... No, 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 no. No. So, no, no, no. <laughs> so, so Nemo. Yeah. If you look at it, he's a. Uh, what you call this? Is um, Marvel's uh, Marvel Aquaman? Aquaman, yeah, yes. yeah, 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 yeah. But he can fly. That's the difference. Oh, yeah, that's that he can fly, bro. So you see, no, you see, you see. These are the I guys. Saw the trailer. I saw the trailer. These are the guys who are really here for the movie because all this information they have. I was just saying, look, um, I came here to to see some of the great, but you guys are really here for the mo for the movie. Because Sampa is not in the movie. He, he probably doesn't even know this Iron Heart. Do you know who Iron Heart is? I know. I know. Who's bro. Iron Heart? No, that's that little girl, but I saw her in this trailer, bro. She can fly. No. Johnny Stark's protege. <laughs> okay, you know what? These guys can go on and on. I know Masu doesn't want to say Masu doesn't want to say anything but Masulani hi. Ah uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Even if I was <laughs> Masulani, are you here to watch the movie or to get some inspiration for some puns? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Speaking of I bet for me it's going to have like a thousand puns. No, it have a thousand. Okay, initially I came here for the fun and everything. But man, the, he want a few. Uh, no, I, I'm, I'm a very fan, bro. Like, yeah. uh, I follow this and also. But the last time I was here, it was because of uh, Chimba and. <laughs> Tony, uh, before I let you go, before I let you go, I can see Charles at like, you know, a touch of, you know, African Stenge, I can see Masalani did it. Tony, what, what was going on? This is not your outfit. I don't know where he got this from. You and me are from Ndola right now. We, I don't know where he got this from. Like, I'm being, I'm being very right yeah. now. Like, I should just put this as a let me From someone. So, here's me dressed up. I cannot stop him. Exactly. So, here's me trying out, oh, Black Lives Matter. I'm all dressed up with black. Yes, in black, yeah. Black Lives Matter. Wakanda forever. Yeah. Gentlemen, it's been nice speaking with you. Clearly, you guys are having a good time. I can, I can see. Definitely. I don't want to disturb that fun. This is cold. This is called Verdant. Inveros Verdant. No, not what you're wearing. Oh, no, 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 no. The dinner tonic. Oh, oh the dinner <laughs> Thank you very much, Robert. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We still have more personalities coming through on the uh, black carpet that we are speaking with. Just had a conversation with Charles, Tony the Goon, and Masulani Zulu. Probably know them through your different social media interactions, uh, especially those on Twitter. Probably recognize those people there. Um, you saw a pass through right here at, in front of the camera and uh, I won't say much about that but how are you I'm good how are you I'm okay um, first of all I love the hair thank you thank you the hair obviously did, did you do this deliberately for tonight or uh, did it coincide I did it deliberately for tonight I, yeah. I needed to go like an extra mile so yeah I'm absolutely loving your outfit so far it looks really amazing um, obviously, it's around Black Panther, but just give us more details around the inspiration. What, what, what made you come up with this outfit? I think I'm a Goni girl, so for me, I thought maybe you know, since it's a Black people thing, I might as well represent my tribe. Yeah. Yeah. So, as we pride ourselves in um, animal skin, so obviously, yeah. What everything? Is there, is there a specific name for this again? This. This is a shield. But is that like a, the local name? I'm looking for obviously, but looking local. Chango. Ah, that's what I was hoping to hear. But also, um, let's talk about your expectation tonight. What are you looking forward to? I'm actually very anxious to see what the, um, what they brought in this in this um, in this uh, series. I'm looking forward to seeing who's the new who the new Black Panther is. Yeah, and obviously mingle with some nice people. Yeah. I've seen a lot of people that are very fashion forward and seem to be lovely people. So yeah, obviously that's what I'm looking forward to. Nice. Yeah. Also, let's talk about. Who put this outfit together? Was it? Did you do it yourself? Did you get like some help? No, I did it myself. Okay. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm a stylist and an upcoming designer. Okay. And that Tio's closet. Ah. Yeah. All right. So. And how long did it take you to come up with everything? 
I'm not gonna lie, this was like a last minute thing for me. Because I, I, I kind of, you know, it kind of slipped my mind that it was today. I thought it was tomorrow. So this whole week I've been procrastinating. I just decided, like, the day before yesterday, like, you know what? I'll just show up as Ngoni Girl. Mm. Yeah. And I think you've done justice. Yeah, justice. You look yeah, oh, you look really you. good. I love your outfit. Thank you. I'll let you enjoy the rest of your night and have a good time. Okay. Thank you so much. All right. Okay. We're still speaking with more people. It's getting interesting. I'm loving the outfits around here. I'm still looking around and seeing more of the outfits enjoying the presence that people are bringing to this black carpet here and hey we've got more designs that you must look forward to as we welcome more people to the black carpet in case you've just joined us on facebook we are building up to the premiere of black panther obviously but it's a vip premiere because the rest of the world everybody else gets to watch the movie tomorrow and uh, come through and uh, enjoy that we also talk about no giving spoilers uh, some have committed to that some may not do that uh, we'll see how the rest of it goes especially with social media maybe in fact maybe i should propose this people should maybe but then there's so many people i was going to say people leave their phones somewhere but um mm, i don't think that's gonna that's gonna work i don't think it's gonna work because you can come out and your phone is not there eh? these things and people show you there eh, this is the real africa wakanda forever my brother but what we'll definitely uh, be doing is speaking with more people here the pr girl media i haven't just put them around here but they should be here soon because look they managed to put this together they may manage to make this happen they have their events for the year the lusaka july's champagne picnics penthouse parties but with the premiere of the black panther wakanda forever for 2022 they decided that you know what it will be good to put this together for those who are interested those who want to come through and have the vip experience those who will be invited as well and they did it a day before everybody else gets to experience it just like we saw in nigeria people coming through with their amazing outfits they brought their a game and i'm looking forward to seeing more of that you know now I'm, I'm, behind the scenes i'm seeing people moving towards the cinema uh maybe that just might be my cue very soon to do so as well because hey you want to get a good seat into the movie and have that amazing experience i'm mean, told the movie is all close to three hours so that's going to be uh, some time of uh experiencing the movies also have to get the movie itself rather also have to get some popcorns but you know what one person i've spotted is the the british high commissioner i need somebody to help me get the british high commissioner there i've spotted him and it'd be nice to have a word with him on the black carpet oh no no we, we've already announced mr high commissioner please tell him we've announced his name already we've announced that he's here and he just has to come through we've announced your name we've already announced that you're here so you just have to come through you see experience you know you know how to call the people you know either come on we've been doing this for a long time see the time of akamba the british high commissioner great to see you and uh welcome to the black carpet good evening how you doing ma'am very well thank you it's lovely to be here Good to see you as well. Yeah, it's great to be here. Yes, it's the official premiere of the Black Panther Wakanda Forever 2022. Did you watch the, the 2018 movie, the first one? Did you take time to watch it? It's, uh, it's a fantastic film. Yeah. And uh, uh, we're really looking forward to, to seeing the sequel today. Yeah. Uh, we just had to refresh ourselves because it's quite some time ago that we saw it. Yes. Um, but really excited to, to find out what's happening yeah. uh, in the next stage of the adventure. What, what are you looking forward to tonight with the movie? Well, even before we get into the movie, yeah. just what a spectacular event this is. Uh, the premiere here in, in Zambia and Lusaka. Uh, I have to say, I feel very underdressed. Uh, and, <laughs> nice, uh, good, you know, black taxi, got black, black, black panda, well, not bad. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I hadn't seen that link. Yeah, yeah of course, that's, yeah. That's, what, that's the angle I'm coming from. Yeah, true, true. But my wife is also a big fan. Y of yes, yes. So. What, what, what? black as well so uh, yeah, we're carrying yeah. the theme through in fact it matches yes. in fact matches. it matches pretty well but what are you looking forward to the most uh, with the movie i think just in terms of uh you know it's based in africa just the the we're really looking forward to kind of like kind of a link between the big movie theater coming back here where we're living now yeah. so just really nice like links and kind of like to be able to support yeah. anything which kind of links uh Africa and also large movie industries. We've been to a few movie premieres here, and, it, and it's just great that the industry is growing and growing. Indeed, indeed. Look, I don't want to take too much of your time. I know I called you right on the spot, but thank you so much for speaking with us and uh, uh, letting us know what you're looking forward to. 
Yeah, thanks very much for having me. And we're, we're uh, keeping an eye out for Sampa the Great and Sheffy 187 yes. and Tio and the others who, of course, have the, 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 the real links in with the, yeah. with the film. So. By the way, which reminds me, I saw you post on Twitter, I saw you tweet about some Inswa. Um, are you enjoying the Inswa? Yeah, uh, so... <laughs> are you actually eating the Inswa? I, so we... We so we so I eat Inswa. Uh -huh. uh, Debbie is not such a fan, uh, but um, the ones we tried to catch over the weekend uh -huh. didn't turn out so good. Oh. Uh, and there was some debate I saw with after I posted as to whether they were actually Inswa or uh, or something that hasn't you shouldn't actually eat. Uh -huh. So um, so I've uh, uh, I've said we need to go and get to the market and get okay. some uh, so we can enjoy them this All weekend. Right. Well, who actually introduced you to? to Inns was uh, as, uh, an interesting delicacy. Who introduced you to it? Well, I'm, I've been here in Zambia three years, yeah. uh, so it's my it's my third, actually fourth rainy season. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I've got to know about it and I enjoy it. But do you remember like the first person who told you, hey, you should try out some Inns, it'll be good. Do you know, I think it was my daughter. <laughs> uh, How old is she? She's now nine, so oh. she must have been about five or six. Oh, I see. So I think she, she heard it from her friends. Oh, and, okay. uh, and she's another fan, oh, actually, okay. uh, of, of Inswa and, and actually Zambian and Queen's cuisine as a whole. Oh. Uh, my, we, took, uh, uh, the, we went as a family to Luapula uh, in July, August, uh, uh, from the Komboka ceremony and toured around a bit. Uh, and my son, who's now six, became a huge fan of uh, Nshima and would eat it constantly and constantly demanded it. And so since then, we've, we've made sure that it's part of his daily diet. All right, pretty amazing. Amazing. Uh, thank you once again for speaking to us, Your Excellency. Thank you. Really appreciate it. And uh, we'll be enjoying the rest of the evening. Thanks very much. All right. We've been uh, joined by the High Commissioner, um, uh, the British High Commissioner to Zambia. And he's been just telling us what he's looking forward to, along with his wife. And we hope his nine-year-old daughter as well will be coming through as well. Hi, how are you doing? I'm doing just good. How are you doing? Yeah, you, you, I'm good. You're looking amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Let's talk about your, your outfit, your insp the inspiration behind it in relation to the film tonight. So I was bringing the old warmer vibes, but bring some young vibes to it. Yeah, so the designer of my, of my outfit was Louis. Yeah. yeah. Pretty beautiful. What are you looking forward to tonight? I'm looking forward to having a, like a good experience and just relieving every African moment in like uh, foreign countries as well. Yeah. All right. It's been nice speaking with you. We hope you enjoy the rest of your night. Yeah, thank you. All right. I've spotted some interesting personalities, more interesting personalities that I would like to speak with. Uh, one of the next people I'm going to call up here. Um, very interesting personality. I saw Denzel somewhere at the back, right behind the camera. Um, I saw Denzel somewhere, and, I, and I'd like to speak with Denzel Chama, who is here at the Black Panther Black Premiere. Denzel! Hello, Chumaka. My man! How are you doing, Chumaka? I'm okay, how are you doing? I feel so much alive. I feel African, actually. Uh -huh. Yes. Woo. Wakanda. Wakanda forever. Let's talk about your outfit, first of all, Denzel. Um, what's the inspiration behind it in relation to the film? Um, the inspiration right here, yeah, behind the outfit right here is um, Ubuntu and us being black, uh, black people. Yes. I know that from the last time you were at a PR Girl event, Lusaka July, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, people had a lot to say about your outfit then. Did you think about that when you were coming here? Yes. I want to be controversial, you know. Okay. When I dress up, I want everyone to talk. Okay. Yes. So do you think you've done that with your outfit today? I know they are watching. Uh -huh. So I'm yet to see what they are up to, what they're going to say. Mm. You, you don't get bothered by, especially the negative things that they say about you. They actually motivate me to do even greater things. Okay. Yeah. So the more they say bad things about you, Denzel, you're like, you know what, let me give them another one. Yes, another shot. I shoot my shots like that. Okay. All right. Um, you, you have a very interesting thick skin for you to be able to tolerate all of that. Um, but what do you think people are going to say about your outfit after this? Probably they've been saying that now on, on Facebook. I know. I don't know. I, don't, I really don't know what they're saying, but yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, um, I know I know you put a lot of attention and focus towards your outfit, but I, are you looking forward to the movie? Yes, I am looking forward to the movie. And the after party, of course. What are you looking forward to the most uh, tonight from the movie? 
live action. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Did you watch the the 2018 one? Yeah. No, the 2018 one, the one before this. Yes, I did. Yeah. Only that sad that Chad um, had to pass. It. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, Denzel, thank you so much for speaking with us. Thank you so much. Denzel Chama, ladies and gentlemen, on the uh, black carpet. Woo! It's getting even more and more heated, more and more interesting as we speak with more personalities here. Hey, who can make a spot now? I'm now calling people at gunpoint. My uh, assistant producer is nowhere to be seen. I, I just can't see where she is now. So that's why I'm calling people as they come through. I can see uh, Amina Kaunda is here. I, I, need, I need somebody to help me get Amina right there she's just right right behind obviously from the uh show on zambezi magic to Vuange with the rest of the team that's uh Mtale Mwanza, that's uh, michi zambia sweetheart and also um uh, natasha van der Maas, just as she was speaking with earlier on amina please come through please come through please come through i don't know where my my producer is she's i hope he's not going to watch the movie Hi, Amina. How are you doing? Okay, how are you? I'm okay. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Oh, we didn't meet earlier on our work, did we? No, we didn't. We missed each other. <laughs> but welcome to the black carpet, first of all. Uh, looking amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Obviously, it's Black Panther, and people have come through dressed according to the theme. What's your, what's your inspiration uh, with your outfit in relation to the movie tonight? In relation to the movie tonight. So, the mask I've seen has black and gold, so I yeah. kind of just figured, as the simple girl that I am, let me just go for the black outfit with the gold cuffs, and I think we can pull it off. Yeah. yeah. Cool. What are you looking forward to tonight with the movie? Honestly, I'm seeing how they've pulled it together without Chadwick, uh -huh. you know, since his passing. I want to see how they've managed to bring it all together and still kind of keep his legacy alive in the yeah. film. That would be very interesting to watch. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, look, I'm, I'm very happy for you. Great work you're doing on Tuvange. How, how's it going hosting a show in Tallinn? It's been interesting. Yeah. Uh, I was just saying, it's the bunch of personalities that I'm with are very dynamic, very yeah. outspoken. I'm used to being the outspoken one in the room. Mm. Now, all of a sudden, I'm being challenged. So, it's been fun, but I'm holding my own, I think. Yeah. 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 You know what? I'll let you enjoy the rest of your night. Uh, see you after. Are you going to be the after party? Yes, I am. Okay. But of course. But of course. Ooh. Looking very dapper, Ooh. by the Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, that's uh, Amina Kaunda, uh, media personality that you can catch on uh, Zambezi Magic, like I said earlier on, with the rest of the team on Tuvange Lifestyle. All right, so uh, still searching. You can come through. I, 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 you've been looking for a while. We can come through. You're welcome. You're welcome. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Welcome. I'm good, thank you. Welcome to the black carpet. Yes, thank you. I, I can see already they're following the theme but i'd like to find out the inspiration behind the outfit in relation to the movie wow i just something african because i'm yeah. proud to be african so i just thought wakanda is representing africa so that's that's me yeah yeah maybe also for the sake of uh anyone watching right now maybe you'd like to also introduce yourself oh um in that's it yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Short and sweet, keep it short and sweet. What are you looking forward to tonight with the movie? Um, actually, seen since Black Panda has died, who is coming to represent him, and yeah, just excited. And it's a black thing, so okay. yeah, all right, all right. You know what? I know people are preparing. I saw some people moving. I don't know if they've gone to watch the movie yet or they're just getting popcorn. <laughs> well, did, you, did you see like the whole movement? I think going? Everybody's starting to head up there now. Ah, okay. At least I'll allow you to do that right now. Thank, Thank you so much for coming through. Okay, okay, okay. Still with more people on the black carpet. And I managed to spot one of the uh, ladies from PR Girl Media. Yeah, I managed to spot uh, Shish Chishimba Monde, who's managing partner. And hopefully we'll be speaking with her soon. That's if she's not already heading towards the movie. Because people are already coming through, heading straight for that. And uh, just want to have a good time. Want to watch the movie, have an amazing experience. But... We continue speaking with them right here, and you catch it right here on Mwebantu TV. You can also let us know through the comment section who are you looking forward to seeing here, who we haven't talked to yet. Yeah, that's another interesting thing. I'm, I'm, I'm spotting more spaces, um, and we'll soon speak with them here. Except my producer ran away. My goodness, my goodness, we're going to find her soon. I'm, I'm spotting someone right next to me. Um, um, it's going to be tough speaking with her because she's quite tall taller than I am. Um, I don't even know if I'm looking forward to that interview, but we'll wait for that. Let me just try my best to 
get some heights in the meantime in preparation for that. But you also share what you're looking forward to with the Black Panther uh, movie premiere. As you watch it, what are you looking forward to seeing from the movie? A lot of people are talking about how they are really excited to find out who uh, the lead character will be, who will be playing um, uh, Black Panther himself or herself. <laughs> Yeah, himself or herself, eh? But we'll find out soon as well as uh, the rest of the night goes. And I keep telling people, no spoilers, guys. Let's keep it professional. No spoilers. Let's try to stick to the theme and make sure that we uh, don't spoil it for other people out there. Let's make people enjoy the rest of the night. Now, one thing that people also be doing here is having the after party. So after party will be going on just around here as well. So people have a good time on a Thursday. So I know for some people it might just be limited enjoyment. Enjoyment is a certain uh, limit. Eh? You can't go too too far. You can't do uh, too much because uh, others have worked tomorrow. Then there's others who are just enjoying. It's another day for them and uh, they're out here to have as much fun as possible. Then there's a third group of people who, uh, for them, them they're used. Them they use them, they can have a good time, they can do their stuff, and they're still showing up for work. Except there'll be zombies, yeah? It's one where uh, you can say, okay, um, guys, he's not ready to be here tonight. So I'm trying to spot some more faces. My brother can come through as well. He can come through, he can come through and speak. Before we get to uh, the top person next to me, at least someone who's about my height. How are you doing, my brother? All right, I'm good, man. Uh, maybe you also introduce yourself to the person watching right now. All right, my name is Glenn, um, LK Designs. I'm a tailor. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, great. Yeah, so I'm yeah. guessing you designed your outfit? Tailor me, tailor me, tailor me, tailor me. <laughs> How long did it take you to put this outfit together? I think about like four hours. Really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so like, did you do this like way in advance or you, you did it like last minute like most people are claiming they did? Actually like last minute, you know, because I was like working the whole week and then it was like... Everyone is just claiming they did their outfit in the last minute. Why? Yeah. Someone is lying somewhere. I know. It's, how can I put it? It's like, it's on a weekday. You yeah. get my point? If it's on a weekend, like maybe people would have like had time to like yeah. prepare their outfits. But it's like on a weekday, so you got to do what you got to do in a short period of time. True, true. I, I get you. Uh, but what's what's the inspiration uh, behind your outfit in relation to the movie? Well, Wakanda Forever is about African culture. You know, and like I've seen, my suit is in a fabric that's Chitenge material, that's African based. So it's all about Africa today. Mm. You know, it's about showing what, you know, the beauty of Africa. And, you know, many people have like so many misconceptions about Africa, you know. Yeah, the voodoo stuff and the everything, you know, like, but we are about to like embrace that culture to say, okay, this is who we are, you know, the voodoo, the culture, the fabrics, it's, it's what makes us Wakanda. You yeah, get I, I like you said, the voodoo. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, right? Because <laughs> there are people that are like, no, the Wakanda movie is like about voodoo stuff, like, that's our culture, man. You know, if you watch the Shaka Zulus, they teach us about our history, about culture, about voodoo, because that's where we're from. That was like our protection, you know, before we had like Christianity and religion, we had voodoo magic, man. That's what protected us from like, from our colonialists. No, yeah, man. All right. Awesome. Well, it's great uh, speaking with you. Enjoy the rest of your night, my brother. Wakanda forever. Yep, it's definitely Wakanda forever as we continue speaking with personalities here. Now, look, the, the top person I was talking about has disappeared, eh? I, 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 she, she's gone. But maybe we'll catch her later on because, look, we're still here. There's a movie in itself and then there's also the after party that more people are looking forward to. So uh, expect that as the rest of the night continues here at Manda Hill. Remember, PR Girl Media have made this possible for people to have the first-hand experience. The invited guests and those who manage to get themselves a ticket and be here. And clearly, from what I'm seeing around the place, it looks like people are about to have a hell of a lot of fun. They're about to enjoy themselves. And also, what do you think about some of the outfits that we've seen here? People have brought their A game. They've come in what they believe is really, really beautiful with their outfits. And uh, we'll see what your reactions uh, will be as well through the Facebook comments section. So let's be interactive uh, through that platform and uh, speak more on that. I, I know they'll probably come through for some pictures here, but I'll, I'll hijack them and speak with them. How you doing, my brother? Good, good, Chimaka. How are you? I'm okay. I'm okay. Hey, that's a deep voice, my brother. Oh, yeah. Wakanda forever, huh? Yo, I don't talk too much because I'm a model. I'm always in front of the camera. So let's talk in more action. Woo, woo. But look, yeah, yeah, you're talking now. Uh, first of all, congratulations for being...
being um, uh, the model of the year, male model of the year. How, how did you feel about winning that with the Diamond TV Personality of the Year Awards? Well, that came as a surprise because I've seen a lot of male model hard working. But at the same time, I realized to say I've been in, in the industry for a long time, almost seven years. Now, okay, tonight it clocks seven years. So winning that, really, I felt like it's an achievement to me because it shows that people recognize the modeling uh, works which, which is happening in Zambia and I'm so grateful to them on TV for the opportunity. Yeah, great. Yeah. I love how you also stuck to the theme uh, tonight. Uh, let's talk about the inspiration in relation to the film. So this one, I saw a picture of uh, our late president, uh, Mr. Kenneth Kaunda. So I was like, because I was struggling what I should wear. I, I had a lot of options and then I was like, okay, let me get a Chitenge, African Chitenge and then spice it up with uh, the Ngoni accessories and what and, uh, and what's on. Yeah, so that's 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 it. It was inspired by KK in right. short. Yes. Right. Well done, Nicholas. So you, you actually won uh, uh, a pass here, isn't it? Sorry? You actually won a, a ticket to come here, right? I, exactly. I saw your name yes, being shared. Yes, yes, yes. I, I, I was planning to... I always have been a fan of PR girls, mm -hmm. and then I saw a competition since I'm a lucky model. I've always been winning some stuff, so I was like, let me give it a shot. And hey, I just saw my name saying, if that's the model you won. Yeah. So, yeah. That's Seems like I'm, you're winning in different well, aspects of your life. You're just a winner. Uh, your maps was right. It's a season. Like, it's a season younger. Yeah. <laughs> well done, Nicholas. Enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you so much. You look good. Take care. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Still speaking to more people. I can see very two, two beautiful ladies who've come through here. Ladies, feel free to come through. I can see the beautiful and lovely precious Ngoma. How are you doing? I'm, I'm okay. How are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. Looking lovely. So do you. It's like you we were matching me, eh? I well. think you were peeping somewhere. <laughs> I wish I was. I wish I was. Let's talk about your outfit uh, and the inspiration behind it in relation to the film? The inspiration is Wakanda. I want it to be a queen, you know, African royalty, so that's what this outfit stands for. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Tell us about who put this outfit together. Was it yourself? Did you get some people on board to do that for you? I always get people on board. I have these crazy ideas in my head that I absolutely love to execute, but the Alexis brand is who I have to thank for putting this together. Mm. Yes. I know that for uh, a lot of people, they knew more about you and you got the attention more especially from last year's Lusaka July with the wings and everything uh, do you think that like put pressure on you going forward like oh my goodness now I need to deliver I need to be up to that standard and, and above no it doesn't I'm obsessed with fashion I absolutely love fashion so I do this because I love it not because anyone expects it of me so it makes it easier and more fun mm. yeah. nice um, is Shakira somewhere around here <laughs> You know, if I'm here, she's here. We're almost together. She's somewhere this side. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? I'll let you enjoy. It seems like everybody's going there. I don't know what, what's there, but... The movie's about to start. Oh, ah, okay. You know what? I think we need to end this broadcast soon because oh, I need yeah, to go. Because I see you have Miss Zambia over there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, of course, of course. I'm going to speak with her. But okay. thank you so much for speaking with us. Thank you so much for having me. All right. Enjoy the night. Thank you. All right. Indeed. Miss Zambia is here. Natasha Joan Maplanga. Okay, my director is finally back. I don't know where she was, but, but she's back. And I can see Roberto is somewhere nearby. It's coming on soon. And now I've been hijacked. Now, <laughs> King Booga, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so Hoof. Haija. Good morning, great to see you here. Great to see you too, man. Um, let's talk about the outfit first. Oh, is this the one from oh. the Nigerian uh, Chilangamuri? No, no, it's our son. We are Africans. <laughs> By the way, you know, we're talking about African pride yeah. and, and, you know, Black Panther being a continental thing. Before we talk about more about that other yeah. event, let's talk about this event here. Uh, let's talk about your outfit first of all. What inspired this in relation to the film? Um, I just wanted to go simple and plain. Obviously, people have made comparisons of me and Shaka, so that's the main accessory. But everything else is just something plain and simple. Yeah. Yeah, with yeah. a bit of accessories, yeah. Um, what are you looking forward to the most tonight with the movie? Um, I'm, I'm someone who really hates spoilers, so I haven't watched any of the trailers, apart from the one that has our song, Zambia Kuchalo. Yeah, apart from that one. So, I try by all means not to watch anything else so that I experience the whole thing. Mm. So, um, my expectations are obviously through the roof. Yeah. This is something that we've 
that we can finally call our own that is done in Hollywood. And I like the fact that Wakanda is is, is not really driven from one culture. It's, it's driven from like a, a lot of cultures. So all of us own it. You know what I mean? You can be from any part of Africa and still feel like this is a part of us. As opposed to if it was like a Swahili culture or a shan, 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 you know, that sort of thing. Yeah. Like this, all of us come together and feel like this is ours. And speaking of Sampa, as a retired general, how did you really feel as soon as you got the news about her being on the trail? Like, yeah, she wasn't on the list of the, the, the soundtracks and, so, and yeah. so on, but how did you feel when you heard that she is on the official trailer her song is on the official trailer well, the, the thing is i didn't even hear about it i saw that yeah, yeah yeah so maybe the experience would have been a bit different if i was expecting it but i didn't expect it so that whole moment was was so unreal man it was it was emotional i was calling some powers calling magnus and yeah. yeah it was it was a great moment for all of us yeah, yeah. all right now um Nigerian Chilanga um, I, I don't know if that's is, is that the in thing now is that the new thing is that, is that what we're doing now first of all Chilanga but yeah. you find that every tribe in Zambia does it yeah. you know that sort of thing um, there are a lot of things that we we direct our energy on where we shouldn't even waste our energy on you know what I mean or sometimes so you think it was you think it was a waste no, like direct whole, energies to that. No, no, no. The whole talking, talking, yo, yo, BCTI was a waste, man. Um, all I saw is brothers, friends of this guy coming together to make this day special for the for the gentleman. You know, in, in Nigerian outfits. I am Zambia. You outfit you for it. And and, and the Igbo chants? The what? The Igbo chants was up when they're walking in. There's a video that also made rounds uh, shouting all these words in Igbo. Because that actually went to Ni Nigerian Twitter was talking about that as well. And they'll be making fun saying, look, they're saying it wrong. Was, was talking about it, man. Don't take one person who said No, 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 it's not one person. It's not it's not one person. You didn't see it? There we go again, wasting time. <laughs> It's, it's people's culture. Even here, it's all about African culture. It's, it's, it's promoting culture. So when people feel like the culture is being spoiled, they'll be worried. Bro, listen, how many times have I come out and promoted Zambian culture? How many? My whole album is called Oli Jabba. If you watch the intro... I love the 2 album, by 2 by the way. Amazing. Like, how, how didn't you have that same energy towards me promoting Zambian culture? How? Why were you sleeping on that and now you want to talk about me? Yeah, just forget it, man. Forget it, bro. Tonight I just want to have a yeah. good time. Yeah. We're here to celebrate. <laughs> King Booker, the retired ah, general. These are the people who push the, the narrative. That should be hushed. I'm just asking the questions. I'm just asking the questions. But, um... I want to have a TV. You know what, I'll let, I'll let you enjoy the rest of your night. Have a good night. All right, take care. Better. Thanks for not walking off the interview. <laughs> All right. Oh, Roberto is here as well. Oh my goodness, you know what? Natasha was also, we're gonna have both of them. Let's do this, because I can't, leave, I can't keep a lady waiting. Um, Hi, Hey, how are you? So I'll start with the lady, Roberto, I hope it's okay. Yeah, how are you doing, Natasha? I'm very well, thanks, how are you? I'm very well, I think this is the first time we're talking since you became Miss Zambia, congratulations. Thank you so much. Um, let's talk about your outfit first of all, inspiration behind it in relation to the movie. Basically, I just wanted an African prince, and what else better than Chitenga itself, and so I went to the best, I think the one that's really powerful with Chitenga's Casilita Design made this thank you very much yeah. and yeah that's about it yeah. are you looking forward to the movie tonight absolutely I think this movie resonates with a lot of black people especially Africans mm. so it's a very nice thing to have people get dressed up and celebrate Africanicity you know mm. amazing I can't wait to see it you know that's the beauty of being Miss Zambia you know you have to be smart you have to know what to say at the, at, at the right time and clearly Natasha is doing that there like I don't even know if that was rehearsed or <laughs> it just sounds so perfect I'm so flattered at Chimweka <laughs> coming from the presenter himself thank you so much Thank you so much for speaking with us, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your night. You too. Thank you for your time. All right. Now I'm with the superstar. If I can feel it better, I had to keep the superstar waiting, guys. This, these are bad manners. If it was Wakanda, I would have been kicked out. 
No, 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 but I gotta say congratulations to Natasha. I think she's doing an amazing job. So yeah, it was worth the wait, definitely. You good? I'm good. How are you doing? We're better. Looking dashing, man. What's ah, the problem? I can't even match up with you anymore. What's going on? Look, the superstar is here giving compliments. Um, sort of red carpet, but it's a black carpet. I hope that's okay for you. That's no, fine. Because I know you like a red carpet before you walk in. No, there's a red carpet there, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah. okay. It's good. But let's talk about your outfit in relation to the movie. How does it resonate? What's the relation? Well, if you look at my colors, they're all representation of Zambia and what it stands for. I've got flowers on this walking stick, basically saying that please, every time, everything that I do, please give me my flowers. That's basically what I'm trying to say. Woo! Woo! I'm getting Mumbaiachi vibes. There's always a message with everything that he's doing at the moment. Uh, but what are you looking forward to the most with the movie? I think I'm looking forward to um, a positive message towards just humanity itself and just the way we all relate as, a hum as, a hu as, as human beings and as friends, you know what I mean? Because if you look at the story um, building up to the movie itself, there was a lead actor that passed away. So now we can't wait to see how they get to unify everybody. So for me, it's more about strength and unity. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Mm. As somebody who's doing well internationally as well, one of our biggest exports, um, how did you feel when, when you heard and saw, obviously, uh, uh, the trailer, the official trailer having some of the great song on it. That was just magical to be honest with you because it's something that we are not so used to seeing. So I feel like this is now opening the doors and you know getting to inspire all of us to do more and get to say okay what is it that she's doing that we can also get to emulate and get to do and maybe even do better. But I gotta say kudos to the production team, everybody that's worked with somebody great. They're doing an amazing job and congratulations to her. Yeah. Alright. I'll let you enjoy the rest of your night, Roberto. Thank, Thank you for speaking with us. Alright, have a good time. All right, so that's the uh, superstar Roberto speaking with us earlier on. And uh, definitely, oh my, oh my, look who's here as well. I, I don't even know if she needs an introduction. Hey, Mtale. Hi, Chimwek. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm okay. I always feel like there's a way that I say your name. Hi, you say. She says it the best way. Maybe that's it's supposed to be Chimwek. But since it's Mtale, we'll let it pass. You're so cute, Chimweka. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. What, the next question? In fact, I might as well give you the mic because this always happens. Are you single? <laughs> this is a retake of Lusaka July. <laughs> it's so nice to see you. You look handsome as always. Thank you so much, Mutale. You look, I'll have the mic back. I'll have, I'll have the oh, mic. Oh, who's, who's interviewing who? Uh, my name is Chumweka. I'm here with Mtale. Mtale is interviewing me. Okay, great. So who are you dressed by tonight? I am dressed by Interfashional Africa. Oh, nice. Who are you dressed by, Mtale? I am dressed by Amberly Tungani. Uh -huh. And I know somebody's going to correct me and say it's Tungani, not Tungani. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, but Amberly made me... Yeah, okay. this beautiful outfit. May I please have the mic back? Oh yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but let's let's talk about the movie. Are you are you looking forward to the movie tonight? Yes, I am. But I'm just worried that it's so long. People are saying that almost it's, three hours long. It's so long, Chimweka. It's so long. I, I, I thought that's how you like the movie. Long? Yeah, you, you don't like it long. Many women often love movies long. Uh huh. I don't think I'm one of those. You don't enjoy it long. No. So, uh, no, not me. So, what matters for the movie for you? If they're big, strong men uh -huh. ah. in the movie. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It doesn't necessarily have to be long. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I I, I hope you'll be able to enjoy it. <laughs> uh, did you enjoy the one in 2018? Did you watch the one in 2018? Yes, I did. I did. Did you enjoy it? Yes, I did. I'm always looking forward to um, obviously watching what the producers have to do this time around, especially the fact that you know Ch uh, Chadwick Boseman is late. Yeah. Um, and I, I really want to know what, what or how, you know, they're going to, you know, hmm, how do I put this? How they're going to preserve his legacy. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know what, what you mean. mean? And yeah. also if there's going to be like some sort of continuity maybe in the next franchises to come, or are they phasing out his character completely? Are we going to continue seeing bits and pieces of him, you know, um, you know, you know, there's a way that movie directors and, you know, think ahead yeah. so that his character could, I mean, his character could either be phased out completely or they're going to throw it forward and, and, and it's going to live on type of thing, you know? Yeah. So for this one, because he's not here, I really want to see what they're going to do. So I'm excited. Uh, when you were 
I don't know if you're the one who came up with the concept for your outfit or you let the designer do it. Which which one happened? Um, I, I love to let Amberly work with her creative uh, okay. space. I love to let her creative juices flow. Okay. Yeah, so she did this by herself. Okay, all right. Hand beaded, she, she put every bead on, on this dress uh -huh. by, by hand, yeah. you know. Yeah. Hand beaded. She's very passionate about what she does. And I just said, you know what? I'm, 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 like, I'm a nudist. I love to show skin, so make sure you just... You know, let me show some leg and some thigh. Yeah, you, you don't mind what the comments will be afterwards. You, you don't really care about that, right? No, I don't. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the skin is thick enough. Yeah, it's large at this point. <laughs> but also, yeah. if, if you have any comments yeah. and um, whatever else, I mean, why should I care? Woo! Um, you've hosted shows outside Zambia. Uh, obviously, remember the days of Kumwesu and so on. But looking at what happened in Nigeria, obviously Europe, and how people were dressed, what do you think about how people are dressed here tonight? I think Zambians are beautiful. I think people look so beautiful. The men look so handsome. I mean, look at yourself. I feel like the, 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 the industry is growing because, let me tell you something. When, <clears throat> when say for instance, when I move, right, there's on average at least 10 families that are fed. Mm. Woo! You know? Woo! Did you hear that? Mm hmm And I am proud of that. And that's where we need to get to as a country. And we need to do more of this. When Michi moves, do you know that there's probably about five or even three people that have been paid and families have been fed from that? Her makeup artist, her designer, her hairstylist. Do you understand? Yeah. So we are growing the economy like that. And I wish the Zambian government could do more and, you know invest more in the entertainment industry we also need to get to a point where we need to start paying tax because people are making money out here yeah you need to pay way, tax as well that's the only way we're going to be respected because if a doctor's paying tax i should pay tax so you won't have that situation of oh never seeing a fear no we're all remitting taxes to zra mm -hmm. so respect me too you know what i mean so i feel everybody's dressed beautifully i feel like a lot of people have been paid you know the industry is thriving this is all money in here you know i'm glad you said I've seen a lot of creativity and designers. Oh my goodness! It's like people are putting their thinking caps on. It's, it's a beautiful night. I'm yeah. enjoying myself. Yeah. Now, before you continue enjoying yourself, uh, one last thing. I was talking to Amina earlier on. How, how's it hosting the show with her? Oh, Amina's feisty. Yeah. And she's real and yeah. she's exciting. She's a breath of fresh air. Yeah. 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 Enjoying it uh, more than with Esther? Um. What? <laughs> why does that why does that question sound naughty? Like I'm enjoying it more than woo, woo, woo. Chimweka, Well, you can tell us something, you know. What do you I mean, mean uh, Chimweka? <laughs> I mean you guys could be star in a movie and make sure it's not long, you know? I'm enjoying it more than with Esther. Uh -huh. Enjoying what? Um doing it together? <laughs> Are we doing it? <laughs> Let me tell you, I enjoyed my time with Esther. Yeah. Uh, you know, she she's no longer on the show. She's a great person. Yeah. Yeah. Amina's new. She's got a new TV gig. Big up to her. Congratulations to her. It's a it's a win for everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, Tell, I know you and I can talk on and on and on and on, but I'll let you go and enjoy the rest of your night, and I hope you enjoy it. Please don't sleep in the movie. Why would you want to talk to a woman like me on and on and on and on? Like, is that all you can do? <laughs> what, what, what else should we do? Any ideas? Watch a movie! Let's go watch a movie! Or make one. But anyway, uh, you can enjoy the rest of your night, Muntale. You're trying to, you're trying to get me killed? Please! Oh, my, my apologies. Yo, we like a banka, and then a papa. Now, we should have a good chef. I'm going to serious relationship. We know. Oh. Yes, I don't have a chance. Okay. I want to do a cool life. Will people be wearing Nigerian outfits as yours? What is wrong with you? No, no, that's a genuine question. It's like saying thing now. I, 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 I'm not shading anybody. I don't, don't involve me in your things. Respect people's things. Naka, <laughs> Naine. All right, Mtale. Uh, Mtale's people are calling and so are my directors. <laughs> the people want you to go, Mtale. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, it's a photo. Oh, my goodness. Okay. All right. Okay. So, uh, as you can see, I'm just being told uh, we are winding up now. Medad, we're winding up. We're about to go. 
You look like you're in the movie, bro. I know, right? Uh, I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm sure you were in there. <laughs> I'm super excited for this because I've been waiting for it for a minute and I just can't wait to see it. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, what yeah. are you looking forward to the most? Iron Heart. Mm. Like, I've been reading about Iron Heart for the longest time and then she's going to finally appear in this movie. Yeah, I want to see El Cuckoo Khan for the first time on screen. I'm really excited. I'm like a really big Marvel head. Yeah. So, like, watching Clearly. it and, you know, watching it a day before everybody else is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Dope, yeah. man. We're going to meet this side. Um, I've been told I need to wind up now, so we so need to go. You know, sure, sure, sure thing. Sure thing. That's my brother, Medad, over there. Well, it's about that time that we go and have a good time. Looking forward to the after party. Look, oh, also looking forward to the movie. Yeah, bah. yeah, yeah. there's a movie first before we get the after party. My name is Chumaika. Thank you so much for watching, wherever you've been watching from. Hopefully, you felt a part of the experience. We'll talk about the movie afterwards. We'll try our best not to give spoilers. But... You should also take time to watch a movie over here at Stuart Kenico Cinemas. I saw PR Girl Media. Unfortunately, I can't speak with them. I don't know where they are. But we are closing up now. Have a good night. And be good and be safe. Can you tell everybody to go inside the time for the movie? Is it audible from here? I think so. Oh, sorry, Grace. Grace.